Hello and welcome to Pink Poodle 2. I am Pink Poodle. Here are my Pink Poodles. Maisie the East End Poodle and Priscilla the West End Poodle. And you can see Dora, the real poodle there, one of the poodles. Um, today we're going to be doing a different type of video for me. Um, it's actually a declutter because I'm thinking I have way too many uh, mascaras open. So I thought this is a good opportunity to um, have a look at what I've got and um, go through them with you. Uh, I know there's quite a few that has to be chucked away because like, I've had them open for a long time. I have ones in here that have not been opened. Um, I have this one that's all right. All these in here are okay. I've just opened that one there, but this is one of my favorite lash, um, eyelash, um, Mascaras is a camera lights one from Tarte. Also, I've got a couple of the um, fast and thing from um, Southern Glory. I've got a You Can Be one, which is quite a nice, like it's like a nice. Um, can't open it. <laughs> component. Um, we've got a, a They're Real and a Bad Girl Bang. I've got this Nutria one here. I've got a Buxom one. So, there are another that have not been opened. And then I have some mini ones. I've got the new one, which is the Hero one that I haven't opened yet because I'm using the full size of this by It Cosmetics. I've got a Bad Girl Bang, but I think, I'm not sure if that's dry or not. I think that's still, it feels a bit dry. I've got this one that's okay. I don't know who this is made by because I haven't been glass on. This is a Doche, Doche one. I've got, um, what's this one? Elizabeth Harden one. I've got a Purr Fully Charged. I think I've got this in a Boxy Charm. Um, I think that one's okay. I haven't used that one, I don't remember using it, so I've got their reels that I'm using already opened. Small ones there. I've got another Elizabeth Arden. This must have been in the room the community sample service. I've got a Marcel one that I know I haven't used yet. I've got a Bobby Brown one that I'm using, I use occasionally. I suppose it should be chucked away, but I don't know. I've got this Laura Geller one. It doesn't want to really be open, so this one. <clears throat> this one I want. See because it's only me that uses them, I don't see, it's a bit clumpy, so I suppose that has to go. So that's Sayonara to Laura Geller. I've got this mascara here. I think we've got in a little, um, what do you call it, birch box. I've got a Models & Co one. I've got another Duché one, which looks like it's not really been used, but it's just been in like makeup for some reason. We have got another Laura Geller one, which doesn't look like it's been used very much or used at all, so that won't go in the ink. We've got a roller lash that looks fine. We've got three types of Benefit lash. I wouldn't buy Benefit anymore because I don't, you know, I have my things about that. have got another Laura Geller one that feels a little bit, you know, sure. it's hard to know, because sometimes what I do is I, I wash the wand and keep the wand and use it for a formula that I like if I like the thing of the wand, so I'm not sure. That's a, that's a maybe. Then I know this has got to be chucked away, which is washing my old, I can't even open it, it's that, it's that old camera lashes, so, so that's got to go. I've got this one here that I've not used but I got it from Aliexpress and it's a pink one which is kind of like a bit of a um, colour pop. I've got a yellow in the same one. I've got this one I do use quite a bit, it looks a bit mucky, which is the Rimmel Wonderfully Real, which I quite like that. I've got this really odd one that we had in a, one of my last boxy charms I ever got. No, not boxy charm. Oh god, got it on brain. Uh, glossy box. I've got a Sport FX one, I've got two Sport FX ones. Um, I don't know if this one's been opened or not. This one looks like it needs to go, I'm not sure. Which... Yeah, I think this one has to go, this one's got to go. Then I've got a pink Ciate London one. It's a very nice thin nib, so that's okay. My Lash Princess has finally got to go, I've had this for ages and I haven't used it for a long time actually. So she's got to go, bye Lash Princess! Then I've got a 20,000 calorie Max Factor one. I've got a couple of those actually. I've got this one that I absolutely love because it's got the one at one end that's thick and one at the thin that goes beyond the bottom lashes. So I really like this one. This is from Ardell. I've got the, the Man Eater one. I finally got a bit rid of this. I've had this a long time. And it's so dry you can put it out and you can't use it anyway. So it's not all my expensive ones that I've got to go. Then I've got a Tartis Tart. I'm not sure there's any left in that. I think that's got to go. That feels really dry as well. Then I've got a Iconia one. Let's see what this looks like. No, that's still okay. 
I've got an Urban Decay one that I've had. That's okay, I haven't really used it as well, you can hear it still. I don't really like the wand on it, so I probably might use a different wand in there. But let's see how that goes. We've got a an Ico Fat Mascara that I think I've had forever. I haven't used it in a long time. Turn it all right. It seems like it's all right still. Obviously if I use it, if I don't use it, I'll chuck it. There's still plenty in there. We've got a Fast Fire um, Soap and Glory one. I think I have a lot of these Sober Glory ones. I know that because I've got a lot of um, Sober Glory one here and they were in it, but I've not really used them. Um, I've got this one, Ultimate Curl by number seven. That feels like really dry, so that's got to go. This one's got to go, which is the one. What is it? I don't know, does it? I think it's supposed to click like that, it? I think that's still okay. We've got a number seven um, Intense Lash, which is still okay. Some of these ones I haven't used, I've just put them in the thing and just basically neglected them now this one's definitely gone this is one we had in a i don't know some pink parcel thing i don't know it's still got quite a lot of product in it but i don't know i don't know that one but that one's going another max factor 200,000 calorie got an elf one here that i bought and it's got that little ball thing at the end which is fine i only used it a couple of times i've got this big uh, girl band that's got to go because there's nothing left in it i've got an exceptional number seven i don't know where i've got all these number seven ones from i really don't know that's dry that's gotta go that one's gotta go see that one then we've got dior this is the one that i got off of um joanne hodgson on a box swap i think that's got to go it's quite dry it's a shame because it's dior but it's got really dry now and you can't really do much with it and then we've got one that i got for a pound which is the max volume where you do one white and then you do the other side to get that. So we've got that. We've got a You Can Be one that's open. Should be following. The three mums go, that's the other one. Then we've got, what have we got? The flatter one. I think this is what we've got this year or last year. So I'm going to get it back because it's not a cheap one anyway. And then we've got another Arconia one that's not open you know, this one. It smells all right. I don't think I've used this one either. So, uh, is that one? And there's that elf one again, trying to get in on it. And then I've got a Wow Factor from Laura Gella. I've had a lot of my Laura Gella ones for a long time. I think I'm going to have to say goodbye to that as well. I had it too long. And then we've got a Rodel one. Which is very dry. My hand is so... Yeah, this is very dry. So... I am keeping two, plus four, no, six, seven. Sugar, 18, 20, 2, 4, 6, 7, 8, 29. I think this is obsession. 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40 mascaras. But some of them are like little mini ones, so we'll get through them quite quickly. This is a nice little bit of them. I want to be um, Stina, which is really pretty. Um, and we're saying goodbye to... Two, three, four, six, eight, ten, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, nineteen mascaras. So they're all nice and they'll be oh, chucking away because they've been open for too long and they've gone dry. And Apparently you have to chuck them away. Chuck it. So I'm getting rid of, as I say, 18 mascaras. And I'm keeping, what was it, 30, 40 mascaras, isn't it? So that's not bad, I suppose, for a little clear out of what I, um, you don't want. I don't think there's much else really I can declutter because I haven't got, oh, what's this? What's this? The, well, is that the fibres? Oh, that's the, fi the fi fibre side. Right. I'm not really... 
into the fibre thing. This is the expensive one that I first started doing the um, fibres with. But I think that one's gone as well, so I'm going to say goodbye to that as well. So I'd say that makes that 20 mascaras. I might keep a little perch though. But I thought I brought a tissue in with me to wipe my hands on. I obviously didn't. I said to Paul, don't chuck away my little box because it's what I use for my rubbish. And what does he do? Chuck it away. That's typical that is, honestly. Oh, and I've got a couple of these little mini um, that you put on your eyes, um, eyelashes to condition them first. In fact, these look like they need to be chucked as well, so I'm chucking these away too. So these are all going. Oops. And I'm dropping them all over the shop. Oh, I wouldn't like to say how much I'm chucking away here, guys. At a guess, I would say mm, up £200 worth, maybe. Because these are like... I don't know what are these... 16, 17 pound each and then these as well and yeah it's probably about two, maybe 160, 70 pounds worth of well they have to go because like you can't keep them yeah I've got those 16 Let's see if I can work this out yeah because I've got like Three. I've got three tart. I've got there is also um I don't know where that's gone, it was the um you know the one Jeffrey Star lights from Benefit, I can't remember what it's called now. That one. I've got two benefit. I've got one. I've got a few um, Laura Gellers here, and they're not cheap either. So um, yeah, so. That's it really, that's all my quick video is, is with me chucking away some of these mascaras. Um, if you like this sort of video let me know and I'll see what I can do about decluttering some of my other stuff. Or actually showing you my collection if you're interested in that. If you're interested in seeing some of my collection of stuff let me know down below and um, I'll sort of video out. So thanks so very much for joining today, I hope you enjoyed it like I said. And we'll see you very soon on the next Pink Poodle 2. Bye guys. Bye. <gasps> it is what it is. It ain't what it ain't. And um, Billy's having a sniff and there's Billy. <laughs> Sorry about that. Almost forgot the same little saying. Okay, take care. Bye. So these are all the actual um, lipsticks. Mascaras I'm actually saying goodbye to. So we've got two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23 um, mascaras. I've counted that, them two there as one because it's one set, but I haven't counted. So it's 24 altogether if you count them two little ones as well. So yeah, so this is all the mascaras I'm saying goodbye to in 2020. So. As I said, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a pause up. And thank you for joining me. And we'll see you next time on Pink Poodle 2. And it is what it is. And it ain't what it ain't. And I certainly ain't having any of these mascaras in 2020. Take care, guys. Bye. Mwah.